Hello friends, welcome back. In this session, we are going to learn something which is most happening. Many people are talking about it. Techies are excited. That's nothing but PyML. PyML is Python Interpretable Machine Learning. It's a new Python toolbox for interpretable machine learning and model development and validation. There are many features which are really stunning. It helps you in developing the machine learning models in validating it and it supports it has got support for inherently interpretable model as well as arbitrary uh, machine learning models when it comes to inherently inter interpretable models it include EBM, GAMINET, RELU DNN and when it comes to the other part of it arbitrary machine learning models it has got tree ensembles, RF, GBM, XGBoost, light GBM, more DNNs are there, kernel methods, SVM, Gaussian process and more Okay, sir, what is it? Why do we have to learn it? That's the first question everybody asks, right? So why is a model interpretability important? A machine learning model is interpretable if someone can fundamentally understand how it arrived at a specific decision. This is going to be a very important point. Listen to it carefully. You can call some machine learning model interpretable if you can understand how it arrived at a specific decision. But why do we need a model to be interpretable? It's very important to understand, right? The higher the interpretability of the model, the easier it for someone to comprehend why certain decisions or predictions have been made. And a model is better interpretable than any other model if its decisions are easier for a human, for you and me to comprehend than the decisions from other model. So this is the way it has been done. This is the way it has been completely built. And this is called as interpretable machine learning toolbox. Well, you can install it with ease. Before we go into the installation, I would recommend you to go through this GitHub page. I will also give this page link in the description where the complete details along with the low code examples are provided here. You can use them from your Colab, the Google Colab, and it's very, very easy to install pip install paml. So pip install paml is the command that you need to use for getting this paml installed. Well, I have taken some of the very simple examples here, which they have given already. You can see that here. So they have given three or four examples available here and they have explained it very nicely. And you can see that examples out here, bike sharing data, California housing data, Taiwan credit data, upload custom data in two ways. So all these are available. So what I have done is I have taken that data and I have run it in my Google Colab. So it's very easy to go ahead and install the pip install PAML is done. And it may take few minutes for you to get this completely done and every step of it if you watch it every step of it is highly interpretable and highly understandable so it goes on very nice so once this is done each step of the code you can see you can initialize an experiment load and prepare the data and it is done very nicely and you can choose the bike sharing so which data you want so you can go ahead with running this step and you can select which one do you want co circles fried man bike sharing taiwan credit what do you want so you can select whatever you want and immediately you get the results and this becomes very easy for you to use. And each and every step, I recommend you to go ahead and try it out because you can update attribute, exclude attribute, all these are possible. And every step you get this very clearly uh, presented and as well as you can visualize things very neatly. Univariate, bivariate, multivariate, you can see the graphs in front of you and this is very, very easy. So you can try it out and you've got options to choose the models, you can see that. EBM, GAMINET, RELU DNN, whichever model you want, you can choose it and you can run with that. And then you can go ahead and register the trained model. So each step, I recommend you to strongly go through it, only then you can understand it better. So try it out and in case you have any questions in that, let me know. But before that, this is a great thing, try it out. This makes the machine learning model building and validation process much easier than ever. Give it a try and I am sure you will like it. If you have any questions, you can come back to me. I will try to understand and I will give you the answer there. Thank you very much for following my channel, the content. If you like the content, give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you.